Okay, we're doing a double today. I'm so sorry I couldn't get one out to you yesterday. And I'm going to move because that light looks like it. Oh, let's see if we can find a place. Okay, is that better? Um, I couldn't get out to you guys yesterday at all. So I'm so, I'm so sorry about that. We have a double today. And I know that some people are getting snow today. A lot of snow. So one of these might be a little rough but write it down and when the time comes you can do it so um today okay today we're going to clean out our closets wait a minute no we're going to clean out our linen closet sorry about that we clean out the linen closet and um we might have covered that one before depending on um where you keep your medicines but you know some houses have linen closets and medicine cabinets so if it doesn't apply to you you can skip this one but yeah, we want to go through our linen closets and we want to pull out our towels that are, you know, kind of getting ratty. Or if you have blankets and sheets that don't match, or, well, not blankets and sheets, but blankets maybe that are getting a little holy or, or sheets that don't have a match or, or getting worn out, you can pull those out and get rid of them. And sometimes I find that linen closets can be a catch-all. You know, there's times when you're rushing to clean up, maybe companies coming in and you just shove everything in a closet. Yeah, maybe it's time to find a place for where those things actually belong. Um, so if you're throwing away or you have towels and washcloths and things like that that you don't need and you can get rid of, you can always donate them. Um, if they're not too ratty, um, you can donate them to animal shelters or animal hospitals and blankets and sheets linens and things like that um you can donate those to places of course you can always donate them to thrift stores but um you can donate those to places where maybe homeless people go um they need blankets a lot of times um linens and um sheets that you're not using anymore uh you could donate those maybe to a women's shelter for better women or you know, places like that where they might need those types of things. If they'll take them, I don't know. Some places will only take new, but those are ideas. And then here's the one that's kind of hard if you're in a place where the weather's bad right now. Um, and that is to clean your car inside and out. Um, get all that junk out of it. My car's a disgrace right now, let me tell you. It is awful. I have so much stuff that I need to... Um, go through and get rid of you know throw away or reorganize because you know my office is my car <laughs> one of my offices but um yeah I live in my car and I work in my car so mine's a mess right now but um yeah uh you might want to think about that give it a good vacuum um take all those pennies that you and change that you throw in the middle part of the console there put those in your in your change bag or your change, oh my God, I can't talk today. I'm so sorry. Your change jar. Remember, we're not going to leave money just laying around anymore. Um, give the windows a wipe so we can see clearly. And that's it. And I apologize when I have to double these days up. I'm so sorry. Uh, you know, sometimes I get busy and it's just hard for me to sneak it in. I don't want to bother my customers if I'm filming in their house and, you know, sometimes at home it just doesn't get done. So I apologize. I know how busy your life is because mine's busy too. So I'm hoping that these things are helping you. And that's it for today. A nice short one. Uh, thank you so much for watching. As always, give me a thumbs up. That lets me know that you like this. If you have questions or comments, I'm, I answer every single one of them. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye-bye, you guys.